Hey guys, so uh, this is Lynn again from Littlefoot Nursery and I wanted to actually make a video to share with you guys some information about um, Shaylin Maxwell from Reborn Sweets Reborn A to Z course and um, I, I am not, uh, sorry, this is just my own review of the course and um, so basically when you get to the website it prompts you to log in so I went ahead and typed in my login I didn't want to do that on camera and you can see that here is a little bit of an intro to the course she doesn't say too much there and then you can see there's dashboard modules bonuses join the Facebook group access famous Facebook group and more so I usually just go I think it's the dash no, no I think it's the modules I go to the modules um, and I just wanted to kind of show you what the different course modules look like and um, I, I just find this to be I found this to be such a helpful course because I was a completely brand new beginner um, as of just three months ago and so you can see we have introduction warming layers neutralizing the vinyl veining undertones first creasing creasing and blushing mottling mottling part two because she does have six mottling layers finishing touches like adding the thin skin capillaries milia tipping the nails uh inserting the eyes sealing brows doing barely their hair so that would be kind of with a prismacolor pencil painting hair rooting lashes and doing combi which is basically just rooting over your painted hair doing full rooting assembly photography thought that was a very helpful module i haven't really photograph my dolls yet but she had great great tips there and then just like creating a reborn business so um let me go ahead and just make this full screen so it's it's really um there's a lot of really helpful tips and i'm going to go ahead and just jump to let's just take veining for example veining undertones and first creasing so and then you can you basically have this very easy menu where you can click to the different modules and she just walks you through it uh, the videos are not as long as some of the other videos that are out there. I, I do also sometimes reference like customdollbaby.com and uh, Denise Pratt has a video that she sells on the Bountiful Baby website or you can access the videos for free on YouTube for like four bucks. Um, and those videos are a little bit longer, but you can see here, this video here on veining and undertones is you know about um, you know, 10, 10 minutes or so. And then she also has these really cool PDF charts. Um, and then and then she also says, brand new to reborning, you can buy materials in a set from Creative Impressions. So I'm gonna go ahead and right click on that and show you. Okay, so you can see here, there's a reborning paint set, paint kit, petite set. So for $110, you can get all the colors you need to do her course. So I did not actually go this route because the this is all for the um, Genesis heat set paints. And I decided early on that I wanted to use air dry paints um, mainly because of health reasons. And I also just, I've, I've heard, you know, kind of things about when you bake the vinyl, you know, the the health concerns that can come from that. You definitely need to have a separate oven. You should not be using your household oven. And, uh, you know, I'm just trying to kind of keep the toxins and chemicals in our family to to more of a minimum as, as much as I can. And so, um, so an air dry versus Genesis heat set paints is probably a whole different video. But anyway, I didn't really go with the Creative Impressions set, but I think that could be a really nice way to go if you're just getting started. So, but this really is a great course. I've learned so much from it. And then she also has a Facebook group that you can be a part of. And, you know, it's interesting. So I had, when I first bought the course, it still, it took me like another two months before I actually, <laughs> before I actually went ahead and, um, you know, decided to, you know, take the plunge and start painting. So she gives you 30 day free access to the Reborn A to C Facebook group. And then after the first month, it's like $20 a month. Um, but the cool thing about this course is you have lifetime access and it's, I think the cost is um, $99. So it's about $100 um, for the course, which I know sounds like a lot, but it is really a complete course. 
and I think it's very helpful for those who are new because she really does walk you through step by step and uh, I don't have an art background and you know I was able to follow along and and you know for the things there's certain things she doesn't go into detail on uh, like you know painting um, like she has a module on painting the hair and you know about doing lips and things like that and eyebrows but she really doesn't have oh and then you can see like she has these PDFs that you can click on and she gives you some tips on how to do how to paint the hair and things like that so I don't want to show those in depth because you know I don't want to give away her information on the course but I did want to at least just kind of show you the lay of the land um, and then she per and then she has like these bonuses like top 10 tips for running your own successful reborn empire materials checklist all of that stuff so so yeah I, I found the course to be great and um, I think it's a it's I think it's great for a beginner and you guys just might be also wondering like how did I know what colors to use if I decided not to use Genesis heat set paints <laughs> this is gonna sound nuts but you know she has I think at the beginning like a materials checklist of you know everything that you're you need to paint um, and it's it's actually a pretty big list so she has this like whole long list of like all the colors all the materials all the brushes that you're gonna need and um, this sounds maybe a little bit nuts but I basically for each of the colors I typed it in on the internet and you know like if it was asking for Pirole red I was like okay what what the heck is that I would basically google it type it into the internet and see what color came up and then I tried my best to just eyeball match it to my set of the Shea Air paints <laughs> so that's how I did it but um, you know I don't think there's like an exact right or wrong like you have to use those colors for the different steps they're just ones that she uses in the course and I think the whole um, way that you develop your own style is by experimenting so for my last couple babies like I've been experimenting with um, like I've been experimenting with AA skin tones, which is with this Tracy kit, um, and she does have a module that talks about ethnic uh, tones, but she is planning to add more to this course. So one of my questions was like, how do you paint the tongue, for example? Like, how do you paint the inside of the mouth to make that look realistic? Or how do you paint, um, you know, or just more information? Like she didn't, she covered, you know, doing eyelashes on a sleeping baby, but she didn't cover rooting eyelashes on an open-eyed baby. So I had all these questions and I would love to see her add um, a module about doing Asian skin tones. Um, so this, this course is definitely a work in process. And she, um, she readily says that herself that it's not something that I think will ever be a hundred percent complete, but, um, but you know, and the other th reason I bought her, um, decide to buy her course is, you know, she, she's a very talented artist. Like if you go to Reborn Suite, like, um, go ahead and type that into Facebook, just Reborn Suite or Shaylin Maxwell. Um, I think you know, even at the time of, that she made this course, she was maybe kind of more consider herself maybe intermediate slash advanced, but, um, she has, she was asked to do, uh, one of the prototypes for Laura Lee Eagle's indie kit. And, she did a wonderful job on that baby and um, so you know her work is really beautiful and you know I, I admired the way that she painted her dolls and so I thought you know why not why not get her course and and see what she has to say and I do think there's a lot of good information here um, but yeah it's so fascinating to me I mean this is an art so there's no kind of right or wrong way to paint these babies it's just interesting because she goes through in certain you know goes through things in a certain order but for example, so for example, she'll do her undertones and she'll do her creasing and blushing before she does mottling. But I do know some artists do the reverse order, like they'll do the blushing kind of as the last step. And so it is really, really interesting to just see her approach to painting. And, um, and I do want to watch other tutorials and learn different techniques. I also have some baby FX paints, which unfortunately are discontinued, but those are the paints that Melissa George uses to paint her dolls. And I would love to experiment with those a little bit as well. Um, I need to find some tutorials on baby FX because there's not a lot of information out there. And um, so anyway, um, but yeah, I just thought I would hop on and share with you guys some information about this course. And I, I do like it. You know, I, you know, maybe there are some that you know, might feel like the information is basic and they're kind of beyond it. But, you know, even the section about creating, creating a reborn business, 
I think is I think it's really excellent because she does talk about social media. She talks about how to leverage Facebook and how to do giveaways. Um, you know how do you gain market presence and you, how do you how to how to set your pricing? How do you run a custom business? Um, problems that sellers face. So I think this module is actually really really excellent. I actually need to remind myself to rewatch it myself. So. Um, but anyhow, I'll go ahead and stop the video here. It, um, feel free to um, comment if you have any questions about it. But, uh, but yeah, if you're thinking about wanting to learn to paint your own dolls or um, you know, either to keep or to sell, you know, this is a, I, you know, I do recommend this as a, a good starting point for beginners. All right, thank you so much, guys. Uh, please like and subscribe.